Let a and b both be real numbers with a greater than or equal to b and b greater than or equal to 0. Consider a line segment with length a, and then overlay a line segment of length b, like this. Use half of the uncovered length of the first segment, a length of a minus b over 2, to create a circle with a radius of a minus b over 2. The yellow line segment created here, connecting the end of the line segment to the center of the circle, has length a plus b over 2. Draw a radius perpendicular to the line segment and connect the endpoints of this radius and the end of the extended line segment. The resulting triangle is a right triangle, so we can use the Pythagorean theorem to determine that the hypotenuse has a length of square root of a minus b over 2 squared plus a plus b over 2 squared, which simplifies to the square root of a squared plus b squared over 2. Next, draw the tangent line to the circle that passes through the endpoint of the extended line segment and draw a radius to this point, creating another right triangle, highlighted here. We again use the Pythagorean theorem to determine that the missing leg has a length of square root of a plus b over 2 squared minus the quantity a minus b over 2 squared, which simplifies to the square root of a times b. Finally, drop a perpendicular from the tangent point on the circle to the extended line segment. One of the newly created triangles in the subdivision is similar to the original triangle. We can see that they're similar because they're both right triangles and they share one of the other angles. Using the similarity of these triangles, we can find that the leg labeled x satisfies the equality x over the square root of a times b equals the square root of a times b over a plus b over 2. We can solve for x to see that x is 2 times a times b over a plus b. Working backward, we see that 2 times a times b divided by a plus b is the leg of a right triangle with hypotenuse the square root of a times b. So 2ab over a plus b is less than or equal to the square root of a times b. But the square root of a times b is the leg of a right triangle with hypotenuse a plus b over 2. So the square root of a times b is less than or equal to a plus b over 2. And then a plus b over 2 is a leg in a right triangle with hypotenuse the square root of a squared plus b squared over 2. So a plus b over 2 is less than or equal to the square root of a squared plus b squared over 2. 2ab over a plus b is the harmonic mean, the square root of a times b is the geometric mean, and a plus b over 2 is the arithmetic mean, and the square root of a squared plus b squared over 2 is the root mean squared. The resulting set of inequalities is known as the mean inequalities. We note that we get equality throughout if and only if a equals b. In this case, the entire picture collapses to a single line segment representing all of the values.